Learning Academy. This video will cover the topic, solving a right triangle. Let's take a look at an example problem to get a better idea of how we can solve these types of problems. Consider this problem. We are asked to solve the right triangle shown here, and round our answers to the nearest tenth. What does it mean to solve the triangle? This means that we will need to find the remaining angle and side measures that are not given with the original problem information. How can we begin this problem? Let's start by finding the remaining angle. We are given two of the three angles, 47 and 90 degrees. Using our knowledge that the angle measures of a triangle must equal 180 degrees, we can solve for the remaining angle. This angle equals 43 degrees. Okay, that makes sense. But how can we find the remaining side lengths? Great question. We will use trigonometric ratios to find the side lengths. We must remember that the sine of x equals opposite over hypotenuse, the cosine of x equals adjacent over hypotenuse, and the tangent of x equals opposite over adjacent. Using 47 degrees as our angle x, we can see that we will need to find the opposite and hypotenuse side lengths. Let's start by finding the opposite side length. Since we have the adjacent side length already, we will need to use a trigonometric ratio that contains both the adjacent and the opposite sides. This is tangent. We will set up our ratio like so. Tangent of 47 equals opposite over 26, and we will solve for the opposite side length. Our opposite side length equals approximately 27.9. Next, we will solve for the hypotenuse. One of the ways we can do this is by setting up another trig ratio. This time, we will use cosine. Our hypotenuse is approximately 38.1. Okay, so our final answer is x equals 43, opposite equals 27.9, hypotenuse equals 38.1, right? That's correct. Okay, so to summarize, when solving a right triangle, we first identify which angles and side measures are missing. Then, we use trigonometric ratios to solve for the missing values. Is this right? Yes! It seems like you have a great understanding of this topic.